Greetings and salutations. Welcome to another KillerSites.com video tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to be looking at an introduction to Photoshop. So all the great things that you'll need to know on how to create images for use in either a web environment, as most of you KillerSites.com students will probably be looking for. But remember, when you're working in Photoshop, any sort of digital photographic image can be converted for use inside of any environment whether that's a web environment or whether you're working for a print industry or doing some work for video or any other kind of digital environment. So Photoshop is an extremely versatile tool. It's one of the kings of the digital imaging world and as you'll see uh, anyone from a designer to a 3D artist to a web designer will be working inside of a Photoshop environment. So while there's a lot that we can do with Photoshop. The fundamentals, the introduction that we have planned here, are going to focus on its use for the web. Now that doesn't mean that we're not going to be learning anything for use with Photoshop in a print environment. Now, of course, certainly anything that I'm going to be showing you in this tutorial can be used in either web or print or any other, for example, video or anything else. However, we must remember that um, due to the fact that we're working in a killersites.com environment. A lot of our students are uh, web-oriented students, so a lot of the images that we're going to be using are going to be ones that will be sufficient for the web, but more than likely would not be sufficient for a print environment. That shouldn't affect us in either way, because whether you're working in print or the web, as I mentioned, all of the tutorials that you're going to be learning here will serve you in any number of capacities. So we're going to start in the next video tutorial and what we're going to be learning is uh, how to work with the basic environment, getting a little overview of how Photoshop works, what you can do with it, and uh, we'll see you in just a second. 